a true value of a walking safari in the African bush, being able to walk up to these elephants and uh, literally enjoy them um, on foot. And you know, the beauty of it is, you know, because of the particular area that it is, you know, there is an element of habituation. And uh, so both the elephants and, and the people, um, you know, remain safe and without incident. In the Manipal's floodplain, we've got these wonderful, iconic bull elephants. Now, this particular guy with the very large ivories, who we know as Boswell, and, you know, he has a, a small um, a, a group of, of cows that, uh, that are drawn to him. And the reason for that is because of the feeding, his feeding habits. He tends to, to share the, the brows that he brings down from the canopy above with the little calves. And that's what you see. Now the wonders of, of sitting on a termite mound and watching Boz is not only is he a very big um, uh, elephant in terms of body size and ivory, but he also has the most magical magic trick, which uh, is not uh, a typical you know, with, with elephant behavior, but he stands up on his back legs. And here we're watching him stand on his back legs and tear the branch off a sausage tree. Now the albidas on the um, on the floodplain, it's called the Faidobia albida, and uh, or the apple ring thorn tree, and that is really uh, where the elephant gets its nutrition from, uh, you know, largely on the on the Zambezi floodplain. It had it produces a seed pod. It's extremely um, high in protein, and so for that reason, it's extremely sought after by the elephants. So here we'd been uh, following him for some time, hoping to get him standing, and there he stands. Amazing, isn't it? What a beautiful elephant and such a true icon of where we where we live and where we're privileged enough to, um, you know, to to be a part of.